Hi guys, welcome to the uh, second lesson here. This is going to be on the pentatonic scale, how to use that in a blues context and how to get the most out of it. Very short lesson, but hopefully you're going to enjoy this. So, this is my pentatonic scale. Now, a lot of people start from the bottom upwards. I always start from the top of the guitar, work my way down, because um, I just think that's where the melody rather than here. You know, but anyway, I digress. Um, what we want to do here with this really simple scale is, because, and the way the blues works is essentially the blues is three different keys. Here we are in the key of A. So A7 to D7 to A7 to E7. There's three keys basically there. But the pentatonic scale um, works off the root. The root um, pentatonic scale works pretty much over those three chords and it sounds bluesy. It's just, that's the sound of the blues. So, but what we can do, we can help each other, because well, my whole philosophy when I'm playing guitar is so that you can hear the chords go past as I'm playing a solo. Uh, you know, unless it's a mel specific melody, but that's what I want to do. When I'm improvising, I want the listener to hear the chords. So how can we do that with that simple chord, uh, simple scale? So it's very easy. We get that note there, which is an A. So we find our A's. A, A, A. There's three A's there. On the uh, fifth fret, seventh fret, D, fifth fret again on the, on the octave. Then we're going to find our D's. One D here. What's the next chord in the blues? D. Another D there. Okay, that's the octave. And seventh fret on the G string. That's a D seven chord. And then we're going to come back to the A. And then we're going to come back to an E. So we've got one E there. Third finger on the A string, seventh fret. And we've got another E there, first finger on the fifth fret, B string. So that's why the first lesson where I said you've got to really get that kind of template of the 12 bars in your brain with that quick change, that second chord that we bring in on the second bar. And we're going to play this now and demonstrate it to you with no chords, just me playing a 12 bar blues using the pentatonic scale. But I'm going to target those root notes. So we've got A, D, chords in So hopefully that's going to give you some ideas of how to practice that pentatonic scale. So go away and do that, guys, and come back for the next lesson. God bless. Take care.